Rhode Island's two U.S. senators, business owners, and other officials gathered to tout the bill, which extends $30 billion to community banks and credit unions for loans to small businesses. It also extends tax cuts and loans from the Small Business Administration. And the purpose of this bill has been to take this $30 billion and to provide them additional capital so they can use their local knowledge, their sense of local responsibility, and their local ability to get things done. The bill passed Congress Thursday with President Obama's support, but the President and Democrats have been highly criticized for ineffective economic policies the past two years. The biggest issue now is whether or not to extend the so-called Bush tax cuts to all Americans, including those making over $250,000 per year. That's something Republicans want. They're quite willing to increase the deficit for a huge tax cut for the wealthiest Americans. But some Democrats are bolting, saying everyone should get tax cuts to help stimulate the economy. Among those defecting, Democrat Frank Caprio, the nominee to be the next governor of Rhode Island. He has a different perspective. Um, my perspective is based upon my understanding and my view of how we can best use very scarce resources at the federal level.